And I hope you enjoyed tonight's movie. Next, from Ulster Television, our Friday matinee, where at 2.45, Tom Adams as Charlie Vine finds where the bullets fly. This spy spoof is at 2.45 on Friday. This is Ulster Television. At half past ten, take better photographs of sport and holidays, a change from the published subject. But now, at ten o'clock, it's time to go over to London for news at ten. And now here's a police message. Within the past hour, a fire has broken out in a hardware store at Main Street, Straban. Police believe it was caused by an incendiary device and ask all key holders in the town to return and check their premises. I repeat, the area affected is at Main Street, Straban. That's the end of this police message. The weather forecast for Northern Ireland, tonight will be cloudy with rain which may be heavy at times. There will be clear intervals tomorrow with showers. These showers will become rather frequent. The temperature will fall overnight to about 4 degrees centigrade, rising tomorrow afternoon to about 7 degrees centigrade. The wind will be strong, force 6 to gale force 8 southerly, perhaps occasional severe force 9 in exposed places tonight. It will veer southwesterly later. That was the forecast. Gus McDonald's documentary Camera comes along at four minutes past eleven. Until then, we have a short film for you on Alaska.
For your further enjoyment here on Austin Television, tonight's next movie presentation is the network TV premiere of the mystic thriller starring Mickey Rourke and Robert De Niro. Angel Heart is at 11.30 tonight. Before Sir Laurence Olivier appeared on screen... We begin. You're watching New TV. Now we go to ITN in London for the latest world news. Over on Channel 4 now, it's Roseanne. Here on UTV in half an hour, we have a full roundup of today's local news. But now, ITN, it's 10 o'clock. Now, the start of a new week, a new look. This is UTV. ...have symbolized UTV from age to age. On opening night in October 1950.
Now on UTV highlights of Italy versus Brazil in international football. Now here in UTV, slightly later than build, a feature-length murder investigation in Taggart. TV, an escaped convict turns Julia's life upside down as Alfred Hitchcock explains. Consider advertising on UTV. UTV, the best catch.
TV. TV for ye. Hookin' ye. Good morning, and welcome to UTV. Double trouble for the Olsen twins now on UTV in Our Lips Are Sealed. And Coronation Street is coming up in half an hour on UTV and again at half past eight with the Tonight programme presented by Trevor MacDonald at eight o'clock. Now, Emmerdale. The pressure is mounting in Celebrity Millionaire at 9.35 and after the news or film is Jaws at 5 to 11. TV tomorrow night, Champions League football kicks off at half past seven. Now, another chance to watch to win with Coronation Street. Ronan Kate Keating provides the music, while Leslie Grantham and Mae McFedridge provide the humour in a special Kelly Christmas special at 8 o'clock, followed by a touch of frost at 9. There's news in half an hour on UTV after Dirt Busters, which contains scenes which some viewers may find disturbing. John Nettle stars in Midsummer Murders at 9 o'clock tonight here on UTV. That's coming up after Heartbeat. Been framed is in 20 minutes here on UTV. After that, it's the best ever hidden camera stunt show three with Philip Schofield at five past six. But first on UTV, the ITV weekend news. It's 20 past five. At 10.30 this evening here on UTV, and tonight with Trevor McDonald's special profiles the courage of Karen Keating. That's after David Jason heads the cast in our drama, The Final Quest. Comedy with Barbara and family in half an hour on UTV, but first the very latest seafaring stuff from the Southampton Boat Show.
You've been framed as in 20 minutes here on UTV. After that, it's the best ever hidden camera stunt show three with Philip Schofield at five past six. But first on UTV, the ITV weekend news. It's 20 past five. warm welcome from all of us here at UTV. We look forward to your company today and we hope you enjoy the scheduled programs. The identifying logos that have symbolized the identifying logos that have symbolized Our very own Owen Quigg has made it to the X Factor final, but will he win? Don't miss it tonight at 10 past 7 here on UTV. Now, though, we cross to London for the National World News from ITV. TV. Expect some strong language from the jungle celebrities now when they hear that the two campers with the lowest votes will face the Last Chance Saloon on UTV. Duke Special, The Furies and The Oscars. Don't miss this week's 7.30 show on Thursday night. Tonight on UTV, Crossing Jordan is at 2.35, right after Brainbox.
Now a new TV later than build and in a change to the episode listed of police camera action, ultimate bad drivers are under investigation. This programme contains some strong language. Now on New TV, the news making headlines around the world from ITN. We now join ITN for a full roundup of today's national and world news. You're watching UTV. It's almost 13 minutes to 5. Later tonight, a Hollywood star celebrating reception in the village of St. Mary Mead turns to tragedy in Agatha Christie's Marple. That stars Julia McKenzie at nine. Now it's primeval. In just over an hour's time, Dermot O'Leary reveals the result of the public vote and which acts will go through to this year's final at Wembley. The X Factor results show is at 8 o'clock. After more contestants join Philip Schofield now and face the cube. Well, tomorrow night on UTV, Joe Machen continues his search for the lesser spotted Ulster, finding it in Cyan Mills in County Tyrone. We'll join him there tomorrow night at 8. Now though, Lloyd feels a bit of a fool in Coronation Street. Thank you. 
We now join ITN for the early evening national and world news. You're watching UTV. It's just after eight minutes to six. We're back in Emmerdale in half an hour. We follow that with the headline makers in our documentary, Emmerdale at 40. Now on UTV, it's the Tonight Programme. Tomorrow night, the remaining contestants take to the stage for the second live studio round on The X Factor at 8.20. And later, David Walliams is just one of this weekend's guests. Back to tonight, we've the third live studio round on The X Factor at 20 past eight. First, Dom Jolly unleashes a host of pranks on our hidden camera show, Full Britannia. Now on UTV, Jurassic Park 3, which contains scenes that some younger viewers may find scary. We now join ITN for the late national and world news. It's just after 14 minutes past 10. Good morning, everyone. For those eagle-eyed amongst you, you may notice that we're looking a little different. This is your new look UTV, and to set us up for the day, here's the very latest news, views and opinions on Good Morning Britain. There's a new look here on UTV, but we've still got the same faces for you. Phil and Holly are here with celebrity chat, features and some tasty tidbits from the kitchen on this morning at 10.30. But first, it's your daily dose of the Jeremy Kyle Show. On the decision makers at Stormont 2. That's View from Stormont, tonight at 10.45. And you're watching UTV. A very good evening to you. It's six o'clock now from the UTV News Centre. It's UTV Live. Day. Now in the first of a new series, Joanna Lumley recalls some of her wonderful journeys to far-flung places. Tonight it's the Egyptian Nile on Joanna Lumley's Postcards. Now, from the UTV News Centre, here's Thursday's regional news and sport on UTV Live. It's six o'clock. Day. Hello, a very good morning and a very happy new year, everyone. Welcome to our New Year's Day lineup here on UTV. In just over an hour's time, Julia Bradbury and Aria Duper present a countdown of the UK's best love walks, the top 100 at 25 past 10. First, Adrian Walls makes a journey to the wilds of Peru to meet the penguins. Hello, a very good morning and a very happy new year, everyone. Welcome to our New Year's Day lineup here on UTV. In just over an hour's time, Julia Bradbury and Aria Duper present a countdown of the UK's best love walks, the top 100 at 25 past 10. First, Adrian Walls makes a journey to the wilds of Peru to meet the penguins.
Thank you.